We're ready to run. And all right, seeing Homebush Gracie a fair break, although Billy T got out better. Carrick's there now. Homebush Gracie goes through the inside. Loco Amigo going forward too. Is followed through by Pico Pico Dawn, who gets awkward. Waterloo Blue getting past that. Then Pico Pico Connor. And we've lost one uh, a mile back there. That's Carrick as they come to the corner. And it is Billy T. Homebush Gracie, the inside. Billy T beats Homebush Gracie, and she remains a maiden. Next to go by then was Loco Amigo. Then we had Waterloo Blue and Pico Pico Connor. And further back then was Pico Pico Dawn. And a long way back then to uh, Carrick, who came to grief going into the first bend. <music> Today, there now. The racing, well, if a fair break here, but Corborn Chesi leads them out here from Lip It Up the inside and Lightning Lou the outside. El Hefe charges through the inside to get into this act too. They'll be followed then by Botany Diane getting a lovely run through. Citrus Appeal has got back. The Lightning Lou's gone back. Hanover State's gone back. Devil's Tongue's gone round a few up. They come. Corborn Chesi in front. Corborn Chesi from Botany Diane. Third to go by then was Devil's Tongue. Then El Hefe. Next one through would have been Lip It Up, Lightning Lou, Hanover State and Citrus Appeal. Racing, brilliant Ashley, just a fair break, starts to accelerate forward now, fair cruising was slow to go, one of the best out, orangey yellow getting to the lead, brilliant Ashley trying to drive through the inside, Ebony Hayes up and around the outside, fair cruising trying to go forward, Manhattan style poking through, Gully Crusher as well back in the pack and so too, Celestial Action and too much sugar, kick and clear, brilliant Ashley goes away to score on orangey yellow and Ebony Hayes third to go by, then we had Celestial Action, fair cruising and Manhattan style were right there as well and behind them to Gully Crusher, too much sugar. Racing, Homebush Ariel out well and pride of Sarah's there too and so too with Snowball Chance. So unbelievable next through, driving through the inside there to Rally Sarius. Behind those runners then we've got Cindy Action, Lily Stopwatch as well back coming to the corner and back is Gully Runner on the corner. It's Snowball Chance in front of Pride of Sarah. Snowball Chance beats Pride of Sarah and Cindy Action to third, followed across then by Rally Sarius. The outside of that was Homebush Ariel who got swallowed up. Then we had So Unbelievable might have headed that in with Linny Stopwatch well back when they crossed in Gully Runner. Racing, Mary Blue Blood average beginning here and big time runnings has bolted to the lead going out after it was Wong full arrest is followed through there by Graham Spick. Here's Mary Blue Blood round the outside. Behind those runners then we had Mini Sprite. Sergio Stars got well back and so too is Gully Yapper on the corner. Big time runnings in front. Graham Spick's taken a couple wide. Big time runnings from Graham Spick. Mary Blue Blood next to go by Wong full arrest. Then we had Sergio Star, Mini Sprite after a gap and Gully Yapper at the back. It's going to take time on us this early in the day. Big time runnings, Jake and Day's Bella double. Racing, V Marina a fair break, but another miss leads them out. Now V Marina goes out hard after it there. Lisa Del Babe was there going past that. They would have been Corborn Mac with purpose. Back behind these runners then. We had Sue Baxter, Apawa Gavin is back behind that. Then Homebush Frieda and Pico Pico as they swing the corner. V Marina gets right away on another miss. V Marina now dashing to second. Corborn Mac, Sue Baxter and another miss who got tired late in the piece. Then Apawa Gavin, not bad. Further back then to Lisa Del Babe, Pico Pico and Homebush Frieda.
Set to go. Racing, Air Express away midfield and Homebush Page has leg to the lead here on You Betcha Becky and there goes Banshee Real and Air Express around the outside. Poking up between runners was Travis Bickle. Starry Baxter is well back and back with them too. Uh, would have been Starry Baxter, Jandal Man on the corner. Homebush Page from Banshee Real. Homebush Page, Banshee Real, Air Express and Travis Bickle fourth to go by. Then we had You Betcha Becky and Starry Baxter. Next to last, Jandal Man and Fear the Beard. Racing, you betcha, and at a moderate beginning here, one of the best out was Nev's way in the outside of that to Amy Baxter, Kiara, Kiara pushing up the inside, uh, between runners here would have been Watch Your Back going forward, on the inside there is Kay Martin, favourites gone back, you betcha, Anna as they swing the corner, sprinting to the lead, Nev's way and holds it down too, Nev's way there on Kay Martin, third to go by would have been Watch Your Back, followed through then by... Uh, Kiara just on Amy Baxter. Further back in the race, we had uh, You Betcha Anna. Didn't have Barn Door Billy in the call of V. Very good. Race 9. For racing, brilliant Jada Affair, break Corborn Gill is there early, so too you know again, trying to press forward and right between them now, Ginger Cole going hard and trying to work towards the lead, Corborn Gill's gone back in a hurry working through runners was Ivanov, Bright Eyes sold and also Little Snicker as they come up to the corner, brilliant Jada in front, trying to gun it down Ginger Cole, brilliant Jada Ginger Cole, then out wide you know again third ahead of Ivanov, fourth to go by, behind those runners then we had Bright Eyes sold with Corborn Gill, Holly Blue Blood never a factor in Little Snicko Racing World Freak Show comes out running the inside. Warboys gets into its work early too, and she's mustered going forward as well around that first bend. And Forever and Ever's getting a hunt thrill on the inside. Fast Rigby working up between runners. Right around the outside, then we've got Opawa Alex making ground further back in the field to Corborn. Excite Forever and Ever starts to drift now. World Freak Show in front by about four or five links here. Warboys running a bit of a race. That'll be followed around the outside then by Opawa, Alex Opawa, Shiloh, she's mustered on the corner, World Freak Show, one dog affair here, and will waltz away to score. Opawa, Shiloh gets the second, Warboys at game third, Fast Rigby was fourth. Next to go by then would have been she's mustered, followed through by Corborn Excite. Opawa, Alex's run came to an end and forever and ever towards the back. Racing. Corborn cares. Just a fair break. Khaleesi gets out well. Kinetic Assassin is there and poking through the inside. Here is Bella Jade. Corborn cares accelerates now. Weave it off Khaleesi though. And behind them we've got, you know, Brent the inside. And uh, out the back there, the seven, the two, the five can't be in it. Round the corner. Khaleesi goes wide. Corborn cares comes the inside. Corborn cares Khaleesi. Third to go by was, you know, Brent. Then we had Bella Jade. Homebush Lucifer was the next one through. Further back in the race then to Raywin, Kinetic Assassin and Shelley McBell. Jean said. Racing, Hujan bolts out towards the lead. Meet Damon off the inside there with Thrilling Mir and pressing forward. There was Mark B. Good followed back in the pack here uh, by Opawa Maff, which ran into trouble. Manu Rama's got back and elite dose. Hujan up to the corner. Coming after it, Mark B. Good. Thrilling Mir thrill on the inside and then Corborn Webb. Hujan lands the Ren Mimbi in the last from Thrilling Mir. Next to go by was Mark B. Good, followed through then by Corborn Webb. Back in the pack there, we had uh, Manu Rama. 
Uh, Opawa Math, well, Meet Damon actually beat a couple of those in, and Elite Dose at the back.